Hello once again. I haven't uploaded a single content in more than two months now. However, this doesn't mean that I stopped playing Ragnarok. I am just having some difficulty finding time to edit my videos. Because of this, I am increasing the pacing of my speedrun videos so that we finish each series with lesser parts. After all, if you watched my previous videos, you probably already know the routes that I take when venturing and leveling up in this game. Also take note that the video I am editing is recorded from way back. With that said, let us watch this video. We ended the last episode at level 126. That means we can now have access to Gramps high turn-ins. My weapon got stripped. Need to re-log to remove the status. The plus 9 wolf officer hat helps us maintain a high damage because it reduces the cooldown of no limit to 60 seconds. That means we can reuse no limit once its duration ends. We're gonna skip to level 130 now. View is upside down due to hallucination debuff. After reaching level 130, we return to town to change our weapon. We're gonna get my virtual bow and Igni's cap at the storage. These gears will allow me to spam Arrow Storm and defeat monsters in a wider area. We are all set now. Let us return to Graham's high turn in. Playing with Arrow Storm spamming is faster compared focused arrow shot. Let us watch some of the clip before I remove most of it. is almost complete. We return to Eden once we complete the hunt. We place all experience rewards to base level placing some stats and skills. Then we grind again. We stay in this map until we reach level 150. Let's watch some more of the clip now. We're going to skip to level 145 now. Upon reaching level 145, we can now take the bounty quest for Senior at Eclage Town. Going to Eclage would normally require the player to do a lot of quest. However, if you have an Acolyte class character, you can ask someone to warp you here and make you Acolyte class save at the infirmary so you can return at this town instantly. We are just here for the Senior Bounty Hunt. Upon completing the hunt, we return to Eclage to collect the reward. We redo this until we reach level 150.
Once level 150 is reached, we can change our location. Level 150 is also the time where I recommend the use of field manuals. I'm going to get the buff here at Hugel Town. All set now. Let us go to the Illusion Turtle Dungeon. Playing here at the first map is safer, but I am thinking of proceeding to the next part of this dungeon. This is the place. We stay here until level 175. Since this is getting repetitive, I will remove most of the clip now and proceed to reaching level 170. Here are my gears if you are interested. At level 170 we get the second costume ticket at Eden. But since we still have some field manual buff, I decided to hunt some more turtles before leaving. Once the field manual buff expires, we return to Eden. use this costume ticket now since I don't like the default ranger sprite. Costume change done. Here ends this episode. On the next part of this series we are going to reach level 200. Like always, thank you for watching. We'll upload the next part within the next few hours, so stay tuned.